color range tool is incredibly useful due to its flexibility. It allows you to select areas of your image based on color. If we want to pick out this roller coaster ride from this image, the color range option should work well. From the menu bar, choose select followed by color range. And we then have two ways of choosing the colors that we want to include in the selection. You can either click on the drop down here and choose one of these colors or alternatively you can choose the sampled colors tool. This uses the little eyedropper and if we come over onto our image and click on the color that we want to include in our selection. So if I click on the dark color gray of the actual roller coaster car you can see in our selection over here it has automatically selected anything with that darker grey. If I want to include another colour, we either come up here to our little eyedropper and select the one with a plus sign to add to the sample, or alternatively, just before you click, press the shift key on your keyboard and hold it down. The eyedropper will turn to have a plus sign and then click on the second colour that you want to include. So I'm going to click on the lighter grey of the actual framework and then you can see that it has almost completed the selection for me. I've got all the roller coaster ride that I want, but then I've got a little bit of shadowy fuzziness around the edge here. So if I then adjust the scroll bar up here, our fuzziness adjuster, if I increase it, you can see that the fuzziness gets worse. But if I go the other way, you can see that it's sharpening the image to just about there that looks good. Once you're happy with your selection, click OK. We can make a copy of that, so let's make an additional layer. Right click, layer via copy. Let's hide the original image and then you can see we've got a layer that we can subsequently use that has just got the roller coaster picked out. So you can see that the uh, color range tool has done a very good job for us of picking out the roller coaster from the image.